Welcome back everyone to another episode of Let's Play Legacy of Cain Defiance. We have just encountered Vorador, who has given us a little bit of information that we don't want to know about. It seems as though it's possible that we can resurrect Yanis Aldrin. See, his heart was ripped out, but that doesn't necessarily mean that that is the end of him. Vampires are a little bit weird like that. If we can return his heart, he can be resurrected. Um, ah, oh shit. Uh, hold on. I think that's what I had to do. <laughs> but, you know, uh, Janos has been... Not Janos. Vorador has been searching for the heart for quite a while and has been unable to find it. So, I mean, I don't know what we can do that he couldn't, but whatever. We're going to have to give it a try, because that's what we do. Ah, jeez. Oh. Oh, uh, there we go. <laughs> I had to remap the buttons in the controller because some weird crap was happening and blah, blah, blah. No one cares. Where is this resurrection? No. Oh. Probably want to step through the hole first. Shit, 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 shit. Ah, damn it. Now I've fallen and I'm, I'm not entirely sure where I am. Ah, damn it. I have to go all the way back. Alright, I made it. Who is buried under the carpet in this weird mezzanine? Doesn't make any damn sense. But whatever. Oh, they locked the door behind us. Sounds like it at least. I'm not gonna go back and check. Furniture? Why do you have a writing desk right there? Why do you have so many fireplaces burning in rooms you're not even in? You never even realize your whole mansion's being taken over by demons and crap? Avernus is in flames, and with it, our hopes may evaporate. How can I find the heart in the midst of such chaos? You must act quickly, but beware an ancient evil dwells within, long unspoken among our kind. Undoubtedly, this is the source of the corruption that infects the circle. If you are to succeed, you must resist its influence. Yeah, buddy. Thanks. All right. <laughs> Open. Depart for Avernus?